Hello and welcome, uh, Sam Oates here. This is my game I created for Ludendare 31. It's called Approaching Grace. It's a Binding of Isaac artistically styled game, um, but you just fight wave after wave of different enemies and get a higher score. It is both single player and two player. Um, if you only have one input device connected, e.g. you just have a keyboard and mouse plugged in, you will control both co players at the same time using one input. If you have a Xbox 360 controller plugged in, one player will control one of the characters and the other con will control the other using the keyboard and mouse. There are pickups in the game. That was a resurrection which will bring back your partner and uh, give you both full health. There are also individual health packets which can be picked up. The different characters in the game themselves all vary in both speed, attack, and range. The skeletons are the fastest creature, but they do the least damage, and are also the most common to spawn. The pigs, or trots, are the slowest creature, but do a lot of damage. There is also a mage character, Archie, who can attack from the furthest range and will aggro no matter where you are on the screen, whereas the other characters will only get aggressive if you get near them or shoot them. Every five rounds a boss spawns, Satan. Satan is of average speed but does a lot of damage, as well as having more than ten times the health as any other mob. When you kill Satan, he will also drop a pentagram on the floor. If you stand in the middle of that, damage will be caused to your character. As you can also see, killing general mobs, and if one of the characters dies, a cross will be placed in their, their position of death. This will also stop you from moving around, but the, the enemy characters can walk through it. It will also stop your bullets from shooting through it, meaning you should avoid them. Pickups will remain between layers, uh, rounds rather, so you can leave them and pick them up when you feel like you need them. So in this case, we can grab a resurrection that was left from a previous round. If we could get to it. And there you go. Bringing back the other character which died. Characters will spawn randomly between 4 plus the number of rounds you are on. So, for example, if you're around 10, between 4 and 14 characters will spawn. Meaning the game gets progressively harder due to quantity of enemy bosses. Again, this was created for Ludendare 31, so it was all created within 48 hours. I used Unity 3D, but I used the 2D part of it. Uh, version 4.6 gives me the new UI system, which is what the health bar is in this case. It's actually a slider um, without a button to drag and slide. The score itself is also linked to Congregate. If you're playing the game on the Congregate website, your score will be uploaded when you end the game. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you enjoyed the game. I'll let this finish off because I'm pretty sure I will die soon. Thank you for watching.